Okay, what we have here is my indoor LED lighting and growing project and uh, with winter coming along in November I thought it was a shame to lose all these plants uh, these are second generation habaneros and uh, pepper plants so I thought right I'll try this out so I've got a cooler, got some soil in and brought the things inside and especially these two fellas at the back here they survived the polar vortex uh, that came down in November so those two came in and uh, we planted at the back, got some seeds at the back there and uh, one seems to be growing and also in the middle we planted in the middle row there um, on the left that'll be a lemon, lemon tree and that one there will be an orange tree so uh, they're pretty, pretty good, pretty good to grow of course grow anything when it's indoors so uh, yeah, back to the LEDs what we've got here is two rows I've got eight whites four blue and eight reds and the reds will take over any power this is actually running from USB it's running from a cell phone charger and the reds will take the power so what you do is you put a variable resistor um, across the uh, well in series with the red ones and until the others come on and you might have to do that with the blues as well but as I say I'm not running at full power here but they're certainly giving out enough light output and uh, all I've got really is a couple of resistors there to control the thing uh, running great from the USB supply and these are doing very well indeed but uh, I just watered them so I thought well I'll grab a quick video and uh, show folks what I'm doing I don't know whether this this foil's doing any good and uh, it doesn't look very good in the bedroom but anyway it doesn't seem to be doing any harm uh, it's also quite interesting to watch the slow motion that these things have you might be able to see with this one here it's reaching towards the light and at the back the uh, the leaves have actually died off and reaching round to get to the most light that they can so uh, yeah it's all been quite interesting over the two or three months to uh, to watch the development of these and how they go towards the light bars anyway there we go that's my LED lighting and growing project for this winter Thanks for watching.